In this lab, we're going to learn a few of the forearm muscles. We're not going to talk about the flexors and extensors so much because we mainly covered those in lecture. But a couple of the muscles we do want to know, we can find right here at our elbow joint. So first thing I want you to notice is at the elbow, we have this V-shaped pattern. So notice how the muscles form this big V. The first part of the V, which is over here, this is going to be pronator teres. Pronator teres. This muscle is going to pull your forearm when it's supinated into a pronated position. So that's the first part of our V. The second part of the V, if I go down to the hand, notice how we're on the thumb side. So this muscle is on the thumb side of the forearm and notice how it's running up into the arm region. So if we remember the thumb is on the radial side and this muscle runs into the arm, we can name it brachioradialis. Brachioradialis, the arm muscle on the radial side of the forearm. So we have pronator teres in front that pronates and brachioradialis on the back side of the V. This is going to assist with elbow flexion. To see our last muscle, we're going to take brachioradialis and we're going to remove it. So as we take brachioradialis off, we can now see some of the deeper muscles. Notice this muscle here. See how it's running the opposite direction from pronator teres. The opposite motion of pronation would be supination. So this muscle here is the supinator or as I like to remember it, it's Arnold's favorite muscle because la, la, you've got to supinate. La, la, la. 